With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. In this question, we have to observe the given finger and we have to select our correct answer from the given options. Now here we can see two different plants have been shown and they are both flowering plants. So we can say they fall under the same group in our plant kingdom. So they are closely related to one another. But what are we seeing over here? On one hand in one plant, in the bougainvillea plant, they are showing us the pointed thorn. Whereas in the other plant, they are showing us the elongated slender thread-like tendril. Now, this is an example of homologous organs in the plants because when two organisms which are closely related or we can say when they have a common ancestor this means they are descending from the same individual they are descending from the same source they have a common lineage and despite this over a long period of time they have undergone such modifications such evolutionary changes that a structure which had a common origin has now evolved towards two different directions and now when we look at them from the outside these two structures even though they have the same origin they are performing different functions and they look very different from each other so this is what is happening over here the thorn of bougainvillea and the tendril of cucurbita both of these structures are formed by the modification of stem so their origin is the same morphologically it is the same structure of the plant body but they have evolved along different directions so that these two plants can adapt to their dissimilar needs so the bougainvillea plant needed some protection that is why the stem modified into these pointed woody structures that is the thorns in order to protect the plant from the browsing animals and on the other hand the cucurbita plants they need some support because they don't have the thick woody stem so in order to grow they need to attach themselves or they need to support themselves with the help of other plants so these tendrils coil around the support and help the plant to grow in a vertically upwards direction so tendril is a stem modification for support and Thorn is a stem modification for protection, but both of them, since they are formed by modification of the same morphological structure in the plant body, we are going to say they are having common origin but different functions because they evolved along different directions so that the plants could adapt to their needs. So, despite having common ancestor, despite having common origin, when two structures evolve along different directions, they are known as the homologous organs having common origin but different function so thorn of bougainvillea and tendril of cucurbita they are homologous organs and homologous organs are created because of divergent evolution that is when the same structure evolves along different directions for adaptation to the needs so over here both of these terms are associated with the image given to us so correct answer is option d both a and c is shown by these two plants these homologous organs have developed because of divergent evolution of the same anatomical structure. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.